as of right now, I am an athlete. When I was younger, I would be afraid of what I'm going to study when I get to university or whether I will get into university and things like that. A few years back, I injured my left knee and I had to go through three surgeries for that. And for me, my health is really important because like, that is what I'm good at. I need my health to be good at what I do. All of a sudden I lost that so to me my greatest fear is you know not being able to get back into the sport. Going through rehab there are times where I have to do the repetitive and boring exercises and you know the treatments. Very lonely and the process of having to go through that is, is tough and the loneliness is what I fear as well. I need to sort of take it one step at a time to accept the fact that I have this injury and things happen for a reason. I need to make sure that I do what I need to do every day to make sure that I can get myself back on track, taking it one step at a time. Each day is a challenge because it's not easy to come back. I couldn't even walk for a few months and it's very difficult to come back to that. You know, every from walking to running to, to being able to do a little jump all that is a challenge. You have to kind of start from the very beginning, like you were a baby. I think it's important that I have good people around me. I'm very blessed to have family to support me and also really great therapists and doctors to help me. I and mean, that has helped me a lot. Besides that, you know, like I said, there are times when I have to go through things by myself. But now I know that I am not by myself because being involved with church and Mission Bridge and a lot of friends and family there to support me, I know that I am never alone even though you know there are times that I have to do things by myself and that has helped me a lot. This period has really helped me to gain a deeper understanding of my faith and belief. In the Bible there are a lot of promises that God has promised us. I look back on that and it gives me a lot of motivation to know that He has good plans for us. You are not alone. F-E-A-R. Face everything and rise. Cut the fear.